The New Yorker suspected of having Ebola is speaking out about the scare. It was a pretty lonely experience just because no one else could come in unless they were wearing like one of those spacesuits with like everything covered. Eric Silverman was doing volunteer work in Sierra Leone earlier this year. He returned home in mid-July and started running a high fever. I had almost about 104 temperature and bad sore throat and stomach issues. After doctors learned of his time in West Africa, the 27-year-old spent three days quarantined at Mount Sinai Hospital. For the most part, I didn't really think that I was going to, I didn't think I was going to test positive for Ebola just because I was starting to feel better. Silverman ultimately tested negative for the Ebola virus. He hopes his experience will raise awareness about the resources still needed in West Africa. Even though it's worlds away or we think it's worlds away from us, it's really, it's really not. UN officials say the outbreak in West Africa has so far killed more than a thousand people. Matt Friedman, Associated Press.